Hey everyone, Shannon Scott with Grave Talks coming to you once more from uh, Mobile, Alabama and the beautiful Magnolia Cemetery of 1836. What a stunning place. Absolutely in love with it. Can't wait to come back and explore it more. It has that bit of that Savannah flavor with Bonaventure, that New Orleans flavor with cast iron vaults, even a little bit of a Colonial Park flavor uh, from Savannah downtown with that brick vault over there. But, um, but you know, French founded kind of city, you know, the original Mardi Gras celebration, just fascinating. Uh, Alabama, I think, doesn't get enough credit for the incredible history of the culture here. Just unbelievable history. But this monument caught my eye. Um, it is like a towering corn stalk of gigantic lilies, Cal and Resurrection lilies. I've never seen such carvings of lilies in all my life. Um, this was for the only child of the Kennedy family, Isabel. She died when she was basically 20, uh, 1875, it looks like. And, um, you know, to give you a sense of the scale, let's go up to this calla li lily here. That's my hand, <laughs> right? I mean, wow, those are huge. Um, so down along the skirting part, of the monument, we have these incredibly weepy leaves that look dead. I mean, you know, you can almost imagine the, like, you know, that house plant you didn't take good care of in the corner of your house with the browning leaves. And that's the expression there. This is the closest thing to the earthly side uh, or the earthly domain of the, the family. So it's weeping, it's mourning. And then you get higher and you have these triumphant musical instrument sized horn like uh, lilies just celebrating, announcing with like a musical celebration of resurrection. Um, and, you know, it's what these, it's what the Victorians in many respects did with their feelings of death. Um, I mean, it's so intense. It's their only child in this case. And they're just casting it off like a fever. They're like, ah, off of me, death. You know, this is the feeling, the celebration of our child uh, living on in, in the eternal with, you know, Christ and, and God and the angels and all that stuff. Um, so yeah, they made something big of the pain by celebrating it largely with the expression of resurrection and life being fragrant in a better place, the ultimate place, heaven above. So, wow, this is just amazing. I have no idea who the maker was or is, but there's no signature. There might be some record of it in the files, but just a stunning, stunning carving. You know, if it's not from Germany or Austria, you know, I would probably guess this to be maybe a Georgia marble, but it's too aged for me to really see it. Um, anyway, wow, stunning. Um, biggest lilies I've ever seen in one cemetery carving ever right here in Mobile, Alabama of all places. Beautiful cemetery, Magnolia, my God. Can't wait to come back. Thanks for watching, guys.